guys learning with rich here in this video let's continue our discussion about revit structure 2021 okay last um video we learned how to create level so this time around we are going to learn how to use a multi-discipline coordination the copy monitor tool Actually, we are just going to use the monitor on the copy monitor tool, okay? Because we don't need to use the copy because we already created the level. So we are going to use the monitor. So we use the copy monitor tool uh, to monitor the elements between the host project and our link model, in our case, the architectural model, or within one project. So let's say, for example, one team moves the level or change the elevation of that monitored level, other teams are notified so that they can adapt their designs or work with team members to resolve issue. Okay, so that is what we are going to learn. So let's open up our copy monitor exercise file. Okay, and then, oops, I don't have here the architectural model, the link model. So as you can see from the project browser, there's the Revit links. You will notice the architectural model here there's an x it's not loaded so what am i going to do is i'm just going to right click this and then just select reload from and then just locate where is that architectural model so in my case this one so i'm going to select that and then i select open to load it inside the project again there you go so there's now my link model so what i'm going to do is i'm going to open the elevation view where I can see all the levels that we have created and then from there I'm going to perform the copy monitor tool all right so I'm gonna select the south elevation for that on my project browser and then again here's our levels so we need to go to the collaborate tab and then you can see here the coordinate panel and then one of the tools there is copy monitor all right so just click that drop down arrow you'll be having two options which is use current project and then select link okay so in our case we're going to select the link option okay select link so we are going to monitor elements from a link project to our host project okay so i'm going to select link all right and then you hover up your pointer to the link model as you can see the outline of your link model the color green right see okay so I just need to select that select the uh, the model the link model there you go so once you select that you will now be going to the copy monitor copy monitor contextual tab okay and then you will see here the tools panel and then one of the tool here is monitor so it establishes relationships between pairs of corresponding elements this tool establishes a monitoring rela uh, relationship between two elements of the same type okay in our case the level the level of our host project and then the level of our link project if an element changes a warning alerts you when you open the project or reload the link model so we use the coordination review tool to review these warnings okay so i'm going to select the monitor there you go and then let us now select our level so i'm going to select first the level of our host which is this one and then the level of our link model and then this one it should be in pair okay so just click and then just zoom out you should be able to see this heartbeat symbol or a lightning symbol or whatever symbol is that so this is the symbol for your monitor so meaning to say these two levels are now being monitored so let's do that as well to the rest of the levels so i'm going to select the level one of the host level one of the link click there you go so there is the monitor symbol select the host select the link there you go there's the symbol select the host link there you go select the host link there you go host link host link that's it as simple as that so that's how you monitor your elements so you just need to select your finish once you're done just click that 
Okay, so just to give you an idea, so let's say I'm going to change the elevation of my level 2. I'm going to change that from 11 feet. Let's say I'm going to make it 8 feet. And then I enter. All right, so this is what I'm talking about. So you will receive a warning, coordination, monitor, alert. Okay, so if I'm going to click the link model, just click that. So you will notice the level 2 here is colored orange, right? Because that means that particular level is being monitored and there's a change that happened. Okay, we deliberately changed the level 2 just for us to be able to see what happens when you edit a monitored element. So for you to be able to review all the changes of the monitored element, what you can do is you can go to the coordination review and then select link and then after that you just select the link model so once you do that you will now be able to go to the coordination review so all the changes on the uh, monitored elements will be listed here so as you can see if i'm going to click this it's now highlighted so that you know what is that particular element that is highlighted so aside from the message here, you also have the action. So it's up to you if you want to postpone that or if you want to reject or if you want to accept the difference or if you want to move the level, level 2. So let's say, for example, I'm going to select this. And then you can also add here a comment. Okay, so you can select the add comment and then uh, move level 2 uh, move the level to uh, let's say 3 feet below something like that okay and then you just select it okay so that's your comment for that so once you select the action here so just select apply okay so it will now go back there okay and then the message will now disappear okay so basically that's how you use the coordination review all right, so same thing. Let's say, for example, the architectural model, the architect open up the architectural model and then they have changed the level. Let's say they, they move the level, okay, and then they save it. And then after that, they send you again that architectural model. So once you open up your project with the updated architectural model, you should be able to see a warning dialog box that there is a change that happened on the architectural model and then again you need to open the coordination review just to make sure what are those changes and then you can now select the action that is needed for that okay you can follow the level for example that they have moved okay so basically that's how you use the copy monitor tool in Revit for multidiscipline coordination all right so hopefully you learned something from this video. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.